right. I've been noticing how horrible driving in this country can be. Or just this area. I don't know how people drive on the other side of Canada. Toronto drivers are crazy. Sometimes I feel like when you're driving in Toronto, Niagara, GTA, whatever area, that people have never actually learned what lanes are for and how to use them. So I have this handy dandy whiteboard. Let me show you what I mean. Three lane highway, okay. The slow lane. This lane is the medium lane, and this lane is the fast lane. And for some ridiculous reason, the slow lane is empty. Why? I don't know. Because nobody wants to go slow, I guess. So there's this whole open lane, and then all these people are just blocking the fast lane. Nobody's passing anybody. So these guys are like driving at the same speed, and you've got this guy going like, less than the speed limit in the fast lane. This is not how it works. You drive in this lane, and then let's say this guy is going like 90 in 100, which he's allowed to, kilometers, no idea what that is in miles. But because he's in the slow lane, it's okay. He's allowed. And you can pass this way and then get in front, and now you're over here. Yay, you did it! Except you can't, which is like super dangerous. This guy is just like, doo -doo -doo, I've got the whole lane to myself. Oh, you want to get on from over here because there's an exit on ramp thingy, my bobber? Good luck, because I'm gonna speed right up on you. If you're the kind of person that does the zigzaggy in between everybody, please know. You're the reason that traffic is slowing down. <laughs> because you're freaking everybody out. And while we're at it, this is the window of your car. And here's your steering wheel. I don't know if that's on the right side, but like whatever. And then there's this handy thingy sticking out of your steering wheel. And it's got like your windshield wipers. Also has this convenient thing. Go up or go down on this little thingy. And it makes this light up here, and then the light will show other people where you're going. What? Nonsense. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm being really sarcastic and awful. That's my traveling woes. Also, people don't know how to zipper. I don't know if they actually use that word here. I kind of stole that word, I think, from Holland. Because in Holland it's called zippering. Uh, Ritze, actually. So that's one side of your zipper. And then the other side of your zipper, it's amazing. And then they just magically like bloop. Imagine those little outie bits are cars. And they just magically just go bloop. Instead of this whole seven people trying to get in front of you when you let somebody in already, just go one by one. It's not that difficult. And everything will just go so much easier and smoother. It's amazing what you can do. So anyway, uh, I'm sure there are worse stories or experiences when it comes to driving and traveling in general. If you agree with anything I said or disagree or have other woes, leave them in the comments below. We can chat it up and uh, hit the like button if you like this video. And I'll see you next time. Peace.